Next one. A test scores are normally distributed with mu 24.1 and sigma 4.3. What is the probability that a student scores greater than 31? So in case we have a, um, a normal distribution with mu and sigma, we can use the table for the unit normal distribution, but we need to standardize the value x. Uh, and you can check that on page 67. So z equal to x minus a mu divided by sigma. So we have 31 minus 24.1 divided by 4.3 and that equal to 1.6 okay uh, you know how the normal distribution look like so we are being asked the probability that a student scores greater than 31 so our mu here is 24.1 this is our 31 and this is the probability required and that is matches the standard normal distribution with mu equal to zero and our z value it's 1.6 and we are looking for that value now if we don't want to go to the z table it's there already in your calculator so you go to your statistics number three you press number one then after that ac then you go to shift stat then you go to distribution number five now there is p q and r so this is p this is a q and this is r so we are interested now for r and the t or the z value for us it was 1.6 so you press number three for r you put 1.6 close the parenthesis it equals to 0 0.0548, which is D.